Transhumanism is essentially the philosophical school of thought that says that human beings should use technology to transcend their limitations. That is the atomic and subatomic and galactic structure of things today. Ray Kurzweil reminds us, 100,000 years ago in the savannas of Africa, when we picked up a stick on the floor and used it to reach a fruit on a really high tree, we've been using our tools to extend our reach. Technology is us. Technology is our extended phenotype, as Dawkins says. Technology is our second skin. The ARM project, in fact, was an idea from uh, 1996. Uh, but at first it was actually imaged as an ear on the side of my head but surgically this was not a safe place i might have had a, a paralyzed uh, right side of my face if we had done it in this location you have meddled with the primal forces of nature uh, kevin kelly who co-founded wired magazine describes technology as the seventh kingdom of life he calls it the technium he says that it's subject to the same evolutionary forces as biological evolution my name is rich lee I recently got magnets implanted in my ears because I'm going to make speakers out of them. The human race is obsolete, y'all. But to be human is to be transhuman. But the reason we're at a pivotal point in history is because now we've decommissioned natural selection. <laughs> basically started as a joke uh, so with my friends after, after I told them that you have meddled with the primal forces of nature this notion that we are now the chief agents of evolution uh, at the moment what we have is only a relief of an ear it's not a three-dimensional ear um, we still have to for example uh, lift the helix of the ear to construct an ear flap and then we're going to grow a soft earlobe uh, using my adult stem cells. Edward O. Wilson reminds us we now get to decide who we become. From now on it's my way or the hayf al-mata al-falaj al-qa'ur bakwi. So it goes like this. You can stick magnets into your ears, get a coil and an amplifier, stick the coil around your neck you got to have a backup supply of batteries like this, but once the coil's on your neck, you can plug a jack into your phone that's amplified, right? <clears throat> Instead of sending it through earbuds like, like it would, you know, with, with headphones or, or whatever, it sends it into the coil. So what does that do? That creates a magnetic field that causes the magnets in my ears to create sound, which is a trip. Freeman Dyson, in the near future, a new generation of artists composing genomes with the fluency that Blake and Byron wrote verses. You have meddled with the primal forces of nature. Biological biotech transformation. We're talking about software that writes its own hardware. Life itself, the new canvas for the artist. Okay, now I have only half a finger what, what to do with it. Tunnelmat oli aika, aika kauhistuneita, että ei, ei sitä ihan niin kuin... Nanotechnology, patterning matter, programmable matter. And that's what stupid people think smart people sound like. Will be ready for us to re-implant uh, the small microphone. And when we have the small microphone inside the ear, connected to a wireless transmitter in any Wi-Fi hotspot, we will be able to internet enable the ear. So in other words, if you're here in Wroclaw and I'm in London or if I'm in Melbourne, Australia, you'll be able to listen to what this ear hears wherever I am and wherever you are. The whole world becomes computable, life itself programmable. I've also got this magnet implanted in my finger and I find that when I stick my finger into my ear and the coil's going, I can hear music coming out of my fingertips, which is a crazy experience. Not a lot of people have had that happen to them. 
Wow, that's the single most boring sentence I ever heard. Upgradable. What does this say about what it means to be human? Ihan heti ymmärtäneet, eikä osanneet ottaa sitä sillä tavalla ehkä niin kuin vitsinä niin käy, mikä vähän kauhistelu on kynnestä sitä muutama hetki päästä, niin ymmärtivät yskän, että tämä hauska juttu on se vahvinen. It means that what, what it is to be human is to transform and transcend. He's either very smart or very dumb. There is another possibility <laughs> with this ear. Um, and the other possibility is that <clears throat> the ear can be a part of a distributed Bluetooth system. So for example, if you telephone me on your mobile phone, I will be able to speak to you through my ear. But the little speaker and receiver are implanted in a gap between my teeth. So if I keep my mouth closed, I, am, I will be able to listen to your voice uh, from your cell phone in my head, inside my head. Craig Venter recently said, we got to understand that we are a software driven species. Change the software, change the species. And why shouldn't we? And you will atone! If I open my mouth and your friend is close by, they will hear your voice seemingly coming from the inside of my mouth. Uh, Some of the questions I've got asked so far, uh, since I've had my magnetic implants, have I communicated with Satan? Um, the answer is no. No, I haven't communicated with Satan yet. We'll see what happens. <laughs> and you will atone. Technology is our extended phenotype, as Dawkins says. Technology is our extended phenotype, as Dawkins says. Technology is our extended phenotype, as Dawkins says. So there isn't a process, as it were, going on in the cell saying, look, be patient. No. It, it's going to be a feather, believe me. <laughs> it's, it, it's, it, do, it doesn't happen like that. Uh, there's got to be a series of advantages all the way in, in the feather. If you can't think of one, then that's your problem, not... Uh, not natural selection's problem, natural selection, um, uh, well, I suppose that is a sort of matter of faith on my, on my mm. part, since the theory is so coherent and so, and so powerful. Matter of faith on my, on my mm. part. I mean, with artificial intelligence, we are summoning the demon. You know, you know all those stories where there's the guy with the pentagram and the holy water, and he's like, yeah, you sure you can control the demon? <laughs> Didn't work out.